During this short movie we will explain why, here at Elko, we use only stainless steel as material for our heat exchangers. When choosing a suitable material for a boiler's heat exchanger, the most important thing to consider is the corrosion resistance. Speaking of corrosion, we should consider two things. Corrosion on the water side and corrosion on the flue gas side. Let's first take a look at the water side of the heat exchanger. A stainless steel heat exchanger is hardly affected by the water quality in the heating system. Whoa! No. Okay, it can work with a wider pH range than heat exchangers made from other materials. Plus, higher chloride levels are not a problem. However, corrosion on the water side is not the most important factor for choosing the heat exchanger's material, as the minimum required water quality is also affected by other materials used in the heating system, such as pumps, valves, pipes and radiators. But when considering the flue gas side of the heat exchanger, this is another story. When operating a boiler in condensing mode, corrosion on the flue gas side will become the most important thing to consider. During the combustion of gas and air, impurities in the gas form acids. In the high temperature part of the boiler, where we only have hot flue gases, the effect of these acids is very small. But when the flue gases cool down further below the dew point of around 57 degrees Celsius and condensate forms, the products of combustion make the condensate acidic. This condensate attacks the heat exchanger surface. Heat exchangers made from stainless steel have a protective chrome oxide layer thanks to a chrome percentage of more than 10%. This chrome oxide layer is hardly affected by the acidic condensate, so the heat exchanger surface remains smooth and clean even in warm and damp conditions. This allows a good heat transfer and high efficiency for the lifetime of the boiler and ensures a high durability of the heat exchanger. Heat exchangers made from other materials, such as aluminium, also have a protective layer. However, when left in both warm and damp conditions, this layer is not resistant against the acidic attack of the condensate. The protective layer will be damaged, corrosion will progress, and both heat transfer and efficiency will decrease over time. This even can lead to heat exchanger breakdowns. If we compare the performance of stainless steel, versus other metals like aluminium, on a time scale of 15 years, we see that only stainless steel has a stable heat transfer rate over its entire operating cycle, offering a durable product with a lifetime high efficiency. Higher durability and constant high efficiency, an ideal combination. That's why Elko chooses to build its heat exchangers from stainless steel, as they perform better for longer. If you would like to learn more about the Elko product philosophy, also take a look at our other videos.